Now this next one is an unconfirmed rumor, so skip ahead if you don't want to hear a potential spoiler. Yesterday we got to see the first trailer for Mark Webb's Amazing Spider-Man 2, and the most talked about scene was that of a shadowy figure walking past Dr. Octopus's tentacles and the vulture's wings in an Oscorp lab. Unconfirmed rumors are circulating that this scene is actually not from the movie itself, but a post credit scene, and that there is a bigger reveal of another villain, and that villain is none other than fan favorite Venom. Dennis, what do you think of this rumor of Venom being in a post credit scene for Amazing Spider-Man 2? I think it's very plausible. Mm. I, th I think, you know, we some people had mentioned uh, when I said, oh, who's the sixth part of Sinister Six? And a lot of people were like, oh, don't you remember Lizard was in jail? And I actually forgot. I thought he died. <laughs> but I still think it's, it's possible that Venom is the one that they're actually going to bring in. And the reason being is I didn't see this in and this is kind of some Zapruder film type of stuff that people told me about. If you watch the trailer and you pause it in a certain scene, the scene where Peter and, and Harry are talking, and they're, they're, there's this giant uh, touchscreen computer, right. and he's clicking through the different like folders or whatever. There's a list of folders, and some of the folders say uh, Dr. Connor's file, Dr. Morbius file, and one of I them didn't notice that. says Venom Storage. So, what? so I, I, I think dripping sweat, <laughs> freeze frame. <laughs> so I think it's very plausible that that yes, this is in fact uh, when they're going to reveal Venom. You know, and let's not forget, a number of months ago, um, there was a picture that director Mark Webb tweeted out of this storage locker, mm. and then a lot of people got very excited because they pulled that for, like one of the older uh, Spider-Man comic books. It looked an awful lot like the storage unit where the symbiote mm. was, right? Um, for, you know, I didn't get a chance to comment on this yesterday. Spider-Man 2 trailer. Oh, I almost swore. Wow. <laughs> so, I thought it was so, so good. I was very excited about it. But, I, I, Dennis, I don't know if this is true. Mm -hmm. But I agree with you. This is plausible. This is absolutely plausible. Especially if he's walking down this corridor that we see in the shot. If he's walking down this corner, corridor and he's just passing by the octopus arms, he's passing by the vulture things. Well, what's bigger and more important than that? What's he walking to? Mm. Mm? The, the, the Venom entity? That's possible. Anyway, Chris Lee, what did you think? I'm excited to see Venom, a new and improved Venom. I am of the camp that loves this new Amazing Spider-Man franchise. Me I too. love Andrew Garfield. I love what they've done. They've bring, they've given us amazing action, and they give you that little bit of comedy that we all love from Avengers and the Marvel films. So I'm a huge fan of it. So for me, I'm excited to see a new and improved Venom. Also, I want to give a huge hug to whoever created these post-credit scenes because they get you so excited for the next film. Yeah, and you know, we didn't even touch on that. If it is indeed a post-credit, it seems to make sense. Mm -hmm. It seems to make sense, but we, we should be clear that there is no confirmation that that's a post-credit scene. Yeah. It could be in the so movie, just but if it is a post-credit scene, I'm kind of disappointed because I don't want to see it yet. I want to see postcards anyway. Yeah. Schnapp, what do you think? I think it's at the very beginning. And then they, show, <laughs> they show Dr. Octopus and Vulture fighting, and then they get killed. And the amazing Spider-Man. Um, yeah, I can't wait. I'm so excited about this trailer. Yeah, like yesterday we didn't chime in on the trailer. I think I watched it like 11 times, 12, 25 times. I can't remember. I lost count. It's an incredible trailer. And, uh, I know, I called you like every 45 minutes. What are you doing, Shep? I'm watching the Spider-Man yeah. trailer again. Yeah. <laughs> Leave me alone, I'm in the middle of the trailer again. Um, yeah, I didn't freeze frame it like what you, you weird, super extra sweaty nerds. <laughs> yes, I noticed in the far left-hand corner of the HD part where if you ma zoom in and then re-res it, I don't know how you found that. So congratulations, super nerd. Whoever found that, now we're now we're informed. We're all Symbiote. going to do it. Yeah, I'm going to do it. Where is mm -hmm. that Zapruder frame? It's a spray frame. Um, so anyway, yeah, I'm I'm super excited the way they're incorporating Oscorp into the origins of all the villains. Yeah. Because yeah. it really helps get all that origin stuff, wrap it in and and make it part of the story so you can just get to the awesome part of Spidey saying cool things, you know, thwipping around and having fun comments. So you it know, streamlines the story. Yeah, it's such a great thing. So I as far as Venom, I certainly hope so. I think it, it makes total sense. Right. So and I hope that guy hopping around in the dark is Mysterio. We'll see. He, yeah. he kind of looks like James Spader from The Blacklist walking <laughs> down that hallway. He does, actually, with the hat and everything. Yeah. If you like this video, be sure to give it a thumbs up. And don't forget to subscribe to AMC Movie News on YouTube. 
It's free and a great way to stay updated with all the latest movie news and check out our daily show, AMC Movie Talk. Also, don't forget to check us out on Facebook and Twitter to stay in the loop for our special prizes, giveaways, and contests.